Hannah Elizabeth, I fall in love with you more and more every single day. See my promise to be your faithful and loving wife, to have and to hold from this day forward. I promise to honor you, I promise to love you, and to cherish you until death do us part. I vow to lead you closer to Jesus and to be with you during the spiritual highs and lows. I promise to keep Jesus in the middle of everything we do, because Hannah, you are a gift from God and a testament of God's grace in my life. Everybody, I just want to say thank you so much for being here uh, today as we get to celebrate the vows of Adris and Hannah. Um, the couple has asked that this would be an unplugged ceremony. As you can see, they've hired some amazing people uh, to take all of the photos that they need. So uh, please, before we get started, take a minute to just silence or power off your cell phones, and we'll get things started here shortly. Thank you so much. Heavenly Father, I thank you so much for Adris and Hannah. We thank you for the way that you've been working in each of their lives to bring them to this point in their relationship. We thank you for the friends and the family that are gathered here today in support of their marriage. Lord, we especially praise you for the salvation that you've brought into both Idris and Hannah's life. I pray that they would remember how you laid down your life for them on the cross, and they would honor that by laying down their lives for one another every day. We ask now that you would bless this time and that your name would be glorified. It is in Jesus' name that we pray. Amen. At this point, I would like to ask, who gives their blessing for this woman to marry this man? Her mother and I. Above all, clothe yourselves with love, which binds us all together in perfect harmony, and let the peace that comes from Christ rule in your hearts. For as members of one body, you are called to live in peace and always be thankful. Adris and Hannah, as each of you submit to Christ and pursue holiness, it is easier for you to serve each other and to love each other and to respect each other. So here's the challenge. Wake up each morning and instead of asking, how is she or he going to meet my needs? Ask, how can I outserve my spouse today? If you both seek to outserve one another, selfishness will never gain a foothold in your marriage. I promise that if you both pursue holiness, God will open the floodgates of blessings on your life and give you a happier marriage than you ever thought possible. It says that love is patient and love is kind. Love does not envy or boast. It is not arrogant or rude. It does not insist on its own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice at wrongdoing, but rejoices with truth. Love bears all things. It believes all things. It hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. With this ring, I seal my promise. With this ring, I seal my promise. Together, as family and friends, we have witnessed the pledging of your love and commitment to each other. Therefore, it is my great privilege to declare you husband and wife. Adris, you may kiss your bride. It is my privilege to present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Adris Koyate. When the world was small and everything was ours, you're taking me back, you're taking me back. When everything moves slower, you're taking me back to better days. Trips, late night drive to our favorite hits Burning through a mixed CD we made Just a couple kids nowhere to be Taking time from making memories Living life like we were runaways Yeah, those were the days You're taking me back You're taking me back You're taking me back You're taking me back When everything moves slower You're taking me back to better days 
Uh, I've known Adri since third grade. We started off by playing football together, uh, and then somehow they allowed us in the same school together, and then somehow they allowed us in the same class together. Makes no sense to me. I know they regret it now. Hannah, today I am the best man for Adris, but just know that you actually have the best man I know. So. You've been my best friend my whole life and like a sister to me. It doesn't matter how long we've gone without seeing each other. We always pick up where we left off. And you are one of the sweetest people I've ever met and you've always been there for me. I'm just so happy that we are here today able to celebrate you and Idris. Um, <laughs> and so we've been by each other's sides for all the big small moments from the awkward middle school days to graduating high school and graduating college and now we're here on your wedding day a day that we've dreamed about since since we were little girls Hannah said that being with Idris made her feel loved and an overwhelming sense of peace that she had never felt before Hannah Idris told me that when he saw you for the first time he thought there's no way that I could talk to this girl because she must be an angel. 